You can so play. First races of the year, and it's Tommy, Thomas, Murdoch, Edward, Rusty, Japanese Bullet Train, Bill, Lady of the Rails, Duck, Arthur, Diesel, Toby, and Mavis. Who do you think is going to win? Veronica, do you want to pick first? Yeah. I know which one you're going to pick first. And Liam, who do you want to have? Go up against Lady. Ooh. Lady of the Rails versus the Japanese JP500 bullet train. This guy has two speeds. We're only going to race him on speed number one. Ready, set, go. They're off, and here they go on the straightaway. They're going ahead. It looks like on speed one, the JP500 is a little bit slower than Lady of the Rails as they go into the curves. They're going to branch out down the heart-shaped track, come around again. This is a very even match. I'm not sure who is going to be winning here. It looks like Lady is definitely ahead here a little bit. We're going to see what happens when they come on through and keep on keeping on. And it looks like Lady finished first overall. This was an upset. I think everybody had the bullet train. Ultimately, Magic Railroad and that Magic Gold Dust goes on for Lady. Veronica, you pick, oh, Mavis. Someone fast. Ah, Toby, the tram engine against Mavis, the far core Corey Diesel. Toby, I think, does really well in these, doesn't he? Ready, set. Go. They're off, and here they go, come down the straightaway. Wow, look at Toby, he is dominating the field as he is definitely ahead of Mavis at this point in time. Entering the curve track, he will go around. Mavis coming in very, very, very much in second place, but the big story here is Toby, as he keeps on keeping on, comes through and he will finish up on the stop blocks. Mavis is eliminated, back to the four quarter quarry for you, my dear. Toby. Once again, showing how fast he has eliminates Mavis. On to the second round. William, which of these beautiful engines do you want to see? Blue. Edward. I am blue. You know what, I'm gonna bring Bill into the picture. We haven't seen him race in a while, I don't think. Edward Blue with his beautiful big long engine and Bill from the Soder China Clay Pits. Let's get him on the starting blocks. Boo hoo hoo, I am blue and I am number two. He's number two and he is blue? Uh huh. And he's kind of a magoo. Two. Ready. Set. Go. They're off and whoa, look at Bill. Edward, he even has new batteries in him, but he is just slow as they go. Here comes Bill coming around that beautiful corner, looking like he's avenging his friend Mavis being eliminated. He is just going on. Wow, Bill, we don't race this guy much. Maybe we'll have to race him more as he goes on to the second round. And Edward Blue says boo hoo. I am number two and I am blue. Sorry, Eddie, it looks like you've been eliminated. That's okay, as long as we got there on time. Well, you didn't, you were much too slow. Next race, buddy, who do you have? Someone odd. Ooh, I'm gonna choose someone odd as well. I think maybe Arthur. Diesel versus Arthur, another beautiful pairing here. Let's see how they do. Ready, set, go. They're off. Good pairing here. It looks like Arthur's gonna slip slightly ahead of Diesel, and he does. Still going ahead, let's see if he can hold on to it. Diesel, usually a pretty good racer here, but it looks like Arthur's coming around the corner. Diesel is slowing down. As they come out of the heart shape, it looks like Arthur definitely ahead now on the straightaway on the outside track. He is ahead by a full length at least. Coming in and he will continue on and win. Score one for LMS Railway. Arthur often not seen in the series, but he came up big today. Down to the last four engine of the first round. William, who do you think is gonna go on? The Great Western Way Duck, the number eight engine versus Rusty, that big square head of his. Narrow gauge diesel, let's get him going. Ready, set, go. They're off, it looks like Duck had a little bit of a head start and he got behind, but look how close this race actually is. I think Rusty is creeping ahead and he is moving ahead now, a half train length ahead, coming around this beautiful track. Let's see how they do on the straightaway, will it be Oh yeah, Rusty now a full train length ahead of Duck. Duck going slower and slower. Rusty comes in and he will get up on there first and Duck will be eliminated. Rusty, big square head himself, comes through and eliminates Duck, one of Dad's favorite engines. The final race in the first round, it shows Thomas, just regular Thomas, not extra fast, not real steam, just regular old fashioned Thomas versus Big Murdoch. Let's see how these guys do. Ready, set, they're off. Murdoch had to have a little bit of a head start there because he's actually pushed by his tender, so he needs his tender, but these guys are nose to nose, neck and neck. 
Murdoch might be a little bit ahead, but regular Thomas coming in loud and proud, coming around that way. He is the first to get out of the loop, and he is definitely ahead of Murdoch at this point in time as he comes through and he will be the first off the edge and Murdoch is eliminated. Well, Big Murdoch can't get a break. We love Murdoch and we love showing him off, but I mean, really, he just needs to get a little bit faster here. Thomas goes on. And speaking of the second round, here they are, our second rounders. Rusty, Thomas, Bill, Arthur, Toby, and Lady. Let's see how they do as we begin the next set of races. You love Toby, but I don't want Toby to win. I think that Bill did very well. Let's get that race going on. Toby takes the workers all the way to the Soto China clay pits and Bill works them so hard that they want to go home. Let's race them. Do you want them to go outside first and then come on the straightaway? Oh uh, yeah. Okay, that sounds good. Ready, set, go. Oh, they're off. Looks like Bill got a little bit of a pop a wheelie there from the hand on top, but he is slightly ahead of Toby at this time. Toby catching up though, definitely as Bill comes around and they come into the corner. Looks like Toby now definitely ahead. Yeah, right on the straightaway. You can tell that Toby is definitely more ahead of Bill and he will go on and he wins. Toby, I wanted to eliminate him with Bill, but apparently Toby is just too fast. Next race, who do you think is gonna do good here, Liam? Arthur. Arthur? I think it's time for Arthur to get a bit rusty. Sleek, big, round, standard gauge, Steamy versus square, small, flat faced, big headed diesel rusty. Let's get them going. Ready, set, go. Off, and they're coming around when they come. It looks like Rusty's slightly ahead of Arthur at this point. Oh, he is well ahead. Arthur has slowed right down as Rusty's coming into the heart shape. And he is going around as Arthur barely makes it. I don't know what happened to Arthur. He ran out of cold, he ran out of water, and he ran out of something. But here comes Rusty coming through the straightaway and he goes on. Arthur, what's going on, buddy? I don't even know. Oh, you squeezed him and he's already going a bit faster. Way to go, Arthur. Final race will show us Thomas and the Magic Railroad as Thomas takes on Lady and her gold dust. Let's race. Ready, set. Go. They're off and here they come around the corner. This should be a very even match. Lady and Thomas, neck and neck, nose and nose, funnel and funnel, foot plate to foot plate, bumper to bumper. Here they come, coming around the big hard track, and let's see who's ahead and barely, wow, look at this, Thomas barely ahead. I don't even know how close this is gonna be, but Thomas is ahead now. Will he continue to be ahead? And he is, and he wins. One of the most exciting races we've had in a long time here, Thomas eliminates Lady, but how close was that, guys? And in the final, we have three exciting trains, neck and neck and neck, Toby, Thomas, and Rusty, we're gonna have a three-way elimination, meaning each one races each other train to see who can beat them both. Okay, Liam, out of these three, which one do you want to represent you? You like that Toby, hey? I'm gonna go with Thomas. Toby's going down, my friend. Whoever wins this race goes on to race Rusty and whoever wins best two out of three. Ready, set. Oh. Here they go, neck and neck, and they are off, and here they go around the heart-shaped track. It looks. Very even at this point. I think Thomas might be slightly ahead, which would make me happy. As they come into the final turn, and it looks like they are neck and neck with Thomas, barely ahead at this point. Look how much it is. He's like a full funnel ahead, and he will go on and win. Tommy Thomas barely beats Toby. Let's see how he does up against Rusty. If he eliminates Rusty, then he will be the ultimate winner today. Ready, set, go. They're off. It looks like Thomas had a little bit of a pop -a wheelie there. They are going very evenly. I think Thomas is slightly ahead of Rusty, which would be, make me very happy. As he comes around the heart shape, and he is definitely ahead of Rusty at this point. Almost two train lengths full ahead. He goes on, and will he finish? And yes, he does, and Rusty comes in second. Well, here is Thomas. The first time we actually raced a, just an actual Thomas, not real steam or not extra fast. And he went on, and he won the whole thing. Toby and Rusty battle of the square hits. Let's finish these guys off, see who finishes in second. Ready, set, go. They're off. Looks like Toby slightly ahead of Rusty, which should make Liam happy. And he is. He's slightly ahead. They're going into that heart-shaped drop. And Toby will come out first and he will definitely be ahead. Look at this distance. There's actually a train length in between them. 
Toby comes in and he will ultimately finish and come in second. Rusty comes in third. And folks, here for no reason is a giraffe handing the trophy off to Tom as today's winner of the Tommy Super Races. Toby finishes in second and Rusty comes in third. Thanks for joining us.